Hello, Internet! And welcome to another episode of Monster Hunter 4 Ultimate! I'm Hamster Bomb, and you are ready to go take down a Gypsaros! Let's do it! Oh man, I'm so excited to finally get back into this game! It has been a really long time since I've been filming. I did every single video up to this point, all in one take, and... Well, not one, one sitting is what I mean to say, and oh my gosh, oh my gosh, I really wanted to get back into this game for such a long time. So, now I'm finally here! I did a couple things offline, well, let me show you what I did. First of all, we really should have been talking to this Wycoon guy a bit more, because I totally ignored the fact that he had villager requests down here, one of which let us um, basically give him resource stuff so that he can give us um, the ability to duplicate honey. Nice! Second thing, you noticing I'm actually wearing armor right now. A full set of armor. I'm no longer completely naked. Let's take a look at what I got. Well, alright, that used to be start, never mind. Status. Alright, my defense is a whopping 107! How did he do it? Let's find out. Well, you see. Okay, it's not letting me, like, sort through everything, but whatever. This alloy helmet is one of those items that, um, you have to, like, get as a rusted thing. Anyway, I was going doing expeditions and stuff. I did not progress the story, guys. Don't think I did. I'm sorry, I just messed around and did stuff we've already seen before, so don't worry about that. Anyway, the alloy helmet is a really, uh, actually, wait, wait, equipment is an option in there. Let's take a look at that. Oh, sweet, there we go. 34 defense just in my head. Mmm, bam, ah, gotta protect my thinker. Anyway, had to take a long time trying to get the, um, abrasives, um, that also, uh, you need those to polish the, um, thing you find, anyway. So, I also found some cool weapons that I'm thinking about polishing later, but anyway, I needed that helmet because I didn't have a headpiece. I just got um, the rest of the things needed for a joggy mail just so we can get the extra defense. 14 there. We still have those Hunter Vagrances. Very nice. The Ketcha Fald, so I got some Ketcha Watcha parts just from fighting in the expeditions. Got his waist. Tetsu Kaber Greaves, 20. Bam! That is so much defense, it's amazing. Not even wearing a Talisman at the moment. I don't even think we have any. We might have Auto Guard, honestly, which is not going to help us with a Bone Staff, which is still where it was last time. Cool. So, I also did a lot of reading, figured out how those um, bugs are supposed to, like, level up successfully with the, um, uh, the buggy stuff you give them. Yes, that, exactly. Um, and I did not give Pepe any things. So, let's get ready to fight against the Rose! Alright, I need to check one thing first. I know I've said a lot of things. Okay, um, we ain't ready at the moment, so... Gibseros is poison type. I remember from the first Monster Hunter game, Gibseros is kind of a problem, so he may pose a bit of a threat to us. I'm gonna bring all the potions I possibly can, just, you know, because antidotes um, seem to be uh, a little bit on the missing side, if I'm seeing correctly. Do we even have any antidote herbs? I can combine to make some, but I'm not even seeing any of that. So, I could load whatever. Um, ah, here we go, we need the blue ones. We actually have 20, that's that's very good. I'm gonna bring 10, just so we can start combining. We need um, blue mushrooms now, I believe. Yeah, the advantages of knowing what you're doing in this game. Oh. I could have just done all my combinations in the box. Okay, since I'm being a dummy, we're doing this the right way. Ah, dang it. Okay. Combine manage items. We're gonna go to combo list, antidotes. There we go. Oh, I have 59 of those. It's fantastic. That's 100%. Boom. Let's just start making them until we run out of the herbs. Cool. Now, glowing grass and a bitter bug. You know what? Um, I have no clue what that's gonna do. Let's try it. Herbal medicine. Nice. Okay. Those are gonna be helpful. I'm not ready to do anything later. Nutrients and a honey, a blue mushroom and a god, but let's just try these. Nutrients, okay, so that's another way to make nutrients. Nutrients and honey, however, makes mega nutrients. Okay, cool. Now, with mega nutrients, I forget what you need that. Okay, you need mega nutrients and a dragon toadstool, we can make probably a life powder, I think. Those are really good, really helpful. Basically, um, it's like a mega potion for you and all of your teammates. Honey plus the first aid med. Oh, so that's like on the fly. You can make a first aid med plus. It's kind of a waste though. Should I start firing these out? I kind of feel like I should. Catalysts. Don't remember what that does. Catalyst and a popfish. Um, whatever. Cleanser. Okay, now I know how to do that. Nitroshroom and honey, whatever. 
Energy drinks. Okay, now I know how to do that. See, I don't really remember most of these things. Catalyst and Adam Seed. Oh, oh, oh. Armor skin. That is good. Raw meat and a dragon toast tool. Oh, okay, so those are, um... Yeah, we might as well make them. The poison meat. Just because filling the combo list is very fun, I think. There are awards for doing it. I did it in, um, 3 Ultimate, which was kind of tough, actually. We only have one stone. I'm a little, uh, a little upset with myself there. Let's see. Sapling iron ore, bomb casings, better. Oh, so these are just a bunch of different ways to, you know. Screw this, it's getting boring. So let's just take items. I'm gonna get those antidotes we just made, those beautiful little things, and we're gonna take all ten of them. Oh, wait, actually, take. We made herbal medicine. No, I know it's in here. Sort. Should be right here. Ah, there we go. Herbal medicine is basically an antidote, only better. It cures you a little bit. So, um, how are we doing? Um, I could bring more steaks, honestly, but we don't need them. Okay, so, that actually looks good, unless I'm forgetting something very crucial. Oh, here's Boogie! I mean, Pink Buns. Hi, Pink Buns, how you doing? We're never gonna get to the skip source, are we? Hi, Pink Buns! Um, so we're gonna change his costume. Since I was fighting so much, we found more Poogie costumes. I know. It's awesome. Hmm. We want the angel leotard. Oh, yeah, we do. Grunt and burp. Oh, he's got burpees. I love you, Pink Buns. Let's get out of here. I'm gonna see you, Pink Buns. I'm coming back later, okay? Right now, I'm on a quest. A quest of awkward Gipsyros proportions and stuff like that. Alright, so we're gonna hit number three. Should be, uh, down here. Shape. Uh, ship shape skin. I was gonna say shape shift, but that is incorrect. This thing will not do anything that crazy to us. It will just poison us and piss me off a lot. There's probably more things that I was doing while I was gone that I've completely forgotten to tell you. Ah! Oh, I forgot to show you the other weapons that I've got that I really want to polish. They're really cool. Um, let's see. Select ingredients. Let's use. Wow, literally only one of them is fresh, and it's thorny meat, so we might as well take that and jumbo bread, get some attack. Attack small health, 10. Stamina, 25. Um, get groomer, game, no. Escape artist, blaster, slider, trainer. Those all really stink, so I think escape artist would be the most helpful there. I don't know if I should be watching this every time, honestly. It's really bizarre. It is really bizarre, guys. Is it just me who thinks this? I think we're just like... It's so weird. It is so weird. I felt inclined to watch it again. That was a hearty meal. Yeah. Okay, so, before I forget. Um. Oh, I can't show you from here. I'd have to go back. Whatever, I'll just describe them. So, one of them is an ice-type switch axe, I think. Other one is a dragon-type lance. And the last, I believe, is a water-type lance? Anyway. Sounds really cool. Like, I really want that ice switch axe in particular. Oh, there's cool. There's antidotes just in here. So, um, we're gonna have to remember that when we come back. As if we're coming back. Right. Oh, wait, I already got some rations. So let me take that. And I'm just gonna get ready to paintball this sucker wherever he is. I don't know. Where could he be? Woo! Boom. Okay, so... Hmm, a Gypsy. Where would I go if I was a Gypsy Rose? I don't know. Where would I go? Hmm. I would go up here. That's exactly where I would go. I would go up here, and I would die. Like, right away. Because, you know, if you do look around in the spider area, I remember from re-watching one of the video parts, you can find Gypsy Rose corpses, like, all over the place. To where it's like kind of embarrassing for Gipsaros, I think, because apparently he's getting owned by everything in the wild. And that's kind of saying something, like, what monster would seriously eat another poison creature? Is it this area? I think it is. There's Gipsaros corpses somewhere around here, but, um, we need to find this guy first. I'm climbing on nothing. Alright, so's. Um, I'm actually looking for those corpses now that, oh, is that one of them? No. So, where are we going? Let's go to 5, 8, whatever is this direction. There's an exit over here. Looks like we're gonna jump in a hole. Boing! 
And another hole, boing! Oh, I would totally do that. Uh, I know there's a, the big spider thing is around here somewhere. And I'm pretty sure that is what killed the Gipsy Rose. Because it was wrapped in spider silk. Kind of scary. Kind of really scary. Considering how I'm... Oh, man, there's a giant spider. That just sounds... Ah, that sounds horrifying. Yep, there they are. There's the corpses I was telling you about while we're trying to find the real one. Um, yeah, you can, like, pause and zoom in. Those are totally Gipsaros, by the way. I know a lot of you guys were like, I don't even know what a Gipsaros looks like yet, Alex. You haven't found it. I'm sorry, I'm doing my best. I don't know where he is. This always happens. This always happens to me. All right, so, um, where have we not gone? We haven't gone to two. We're going to two. Watch, it was going to be the second area. We were supposed to go in right away. But why would he be over there? It's like a pretty little crystalline area. Why would he even be in this area? I don't know. Oh, he's not even here. Okay, so we're going to three. I guess three makes a little bit more sense because it's like a disgusting nest of some sort. I'm not sure. No clue. Oh, yep, he's totally in here. Yay! Cutscene! Woo! Yep, uh, that's me. Looking around with my new shiny helmet. Oh, God! Oh, hi there! Hey, buddy! You are a giant rubber turkey. Whoa! Your tail is very sexual. Oh, okay. I won! I won! I killed it! I won! I... Seriously? Is it dead? No way, they just let it die. Oh, God! Okay, I'm going. I'm getting out of here. Time to hightail it. Oh, God. Oh, I remember that move from the first game. Oh, crappage. That was not fair. Woo! Okay, now we're into this fight. Oh, noticed. Oh, I forgot one thing. He's actually weak to fire. Which buggy hit him. Please don't touch me, please don't touch me, please don't touch me. Ow! Potion was still... I forgot about that! He steals your items! I forgot about that! I forgot about that! Oh my god, I think he's so mad! Dang it, Kabuto! No, stop making me dizzy! No, no, I'm poisoned! I'm just gonna kill somebody right now. Good thing we have this extra defense, because... Wait, what's that do? Uh, it's just, a. Uh... Health. Oh god, oh god, no, 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 no. Oh, this defense though is amazing. Alright. Enough, uh. Enough acting like a friggin' idiot. Let's kill it. Woo! Come on, Kabuto, hurry up! Come on, get another one. Okay, white will do. I'm good with that. I'm fine. Come on now. We gotta take this thing out. Oh, sorry, by the way, I've noticed, um, someone did send a message, and by someone I mean, like, several people, um, wondering if I could try some more weapons, just to show you all, and I totally will, um, as soon as we're out of, like, the early game monsters, which we're getting close. Ah, oh, god. The thing is, right now, I really, um, want to get good with this weapon class, because I've never used it before. <laughs> nice! We're on back! Specifically, um, people are asking me to use the charge blade, which is oh god, stay, stay, no, stay, we're staying, and we're staying, and we're good. Chop, 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 chop. Come on, Gippy, fall over. People wanted me to use the charge blade, the new weapon class, um, which I know this is also a new weapon class, and personally, I prefer this one just because of um, I have used both from the demo. You will see charge blade action. Don't think I'm just going to be one of those people who's only going to use one. Oh, type of weapon. Oh, shoot. Did my yellow just bounce off of it? Oh, God. I believe that thing just went into a rage mode. That would be an uh, accurate assumption. Got an idea here. Okay, so, remember there was an attack where I could, like, leap. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. I don't even know what it's doing, but I just don't want any of that. I've never... At least I don't remember seeing any Gipsros flying. Oh god! Oh my god, that was horrifying! Leave me alone! Oh my god! Okay, um, antidotes. Need it. Where is it? Oh my god, where is it? 
Oh god. <laughs> Pepe, help me. Good thing I got this awesome armor before doing this. Ah! Supplies are delivered. Wait a minute. Did it really say that? Oh god, that was close. Now that was um, a really extensive leap there. I was kind of hoping he would just kind of drop down. Oh shoot, hold, 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 hold. Stab, 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 stab. No, we can make it, we can make it. Oh, he beat me, dang it. I was hoping I'd be able to bust my way through that, but I did not. All right, I think we need to use more attacks with the bug. Just because the bug is fire type at the moment. Or at least he's doing fire damage. He clearly is doing fire damage. Alright, so, looks like he's gonna wuss out of here, and I don't have him on paintball. That was dumb. That was really dumb. It's the cutscenes. They, they like, confuse me. Oh, wait, he flew, like, that way. You can't even leave that way. Okay, so he went through a cave. Still technically here. Now he's flying that direction. Well, I guess he has to, just because there's only two exits out of here. Let's go figure out where he is, where he is, where he is. So, um, I'm not sure what kind of weapon class to choose next, honestly. So he's not in this area. I'm going to assume he's in two. I mean, I really want to stick with the insect glade for a while. It's because I like getting really good at um, different weapons. But, personally, I don't really like the charge blade that much. It's good, but, um, I don't know. You here? He's not here either. Where'd you go? Gippy! Some people say Gyps arose too, and... Whatever. I can call him Gippy. You can call him Jippy. There you are! Oh, you were eaten, weren't you? That makes me very sad. Woo! Alright, get some color. There we go. Alright, we got a white. Now pretty much anything else will give us some combo abilities. Woo! It was close. While his face was right there, I really wanted to hit up some red. Oh god. Nope. Oh, okay, that was close. Oh, I forgot. Again. Paintball. Uh, how about we wait till he has, uh, he's done with his temper tantrum? There we go. So, Pepe, I'm not healing you. You gotta take, take, pair, take, pair, 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 take of care, take. Take care of yourself! I don't know how I lived, but I did. Woo! Alright, so I already need some more buggy powers. Ooh! Someone... Someone's out of his power. Not quite what I wanted, but I'm cool with it. Alright, how about another one of those? Yep, he's got a rubbery tail of sorts that's like slapping. He's just a weird monster. He's weird. He's. Oh, God. Really? Are you serious? You gotta be joking me. So, we're going to be fighting a lot of monsters today, it looks like, because apparently we can take, like, all of them down. Whoa! He just walked up the cliff. Let's get him, let's get him. Oh, dag nabbit. Get back here. Oh, just a little close. A little close. I was, I was short. So then, whatever. Um... It's like I accidentally took a real potion at one point. Whatever. Kind of want to go back and to the base camp and just grab the freebies. Because there are freebies. But whatever. It's not worth it. I'm not going to catch that on film. Wait. This is not the right way. Apparently you went way up here. You should go to, uh, I think it's area, is it area 7? Where all the other dead Gipsaros are kind of amusing he's heading this direction oh god that didn't sound good oh, 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 oh. he knows we're here just oh god oh god he's pissed he's so pissed 
Okay then. Okay then. Okay. Nope, nope, none of that. None of that. You sit down. What? What happened? If it's dead, why'd the quest not end? If it's dead, why is the quest not over? Something's wrong. Something's wrong. Something's wrong. Something's wrong. Something's wrong. Something is so wrong. Oh god! <laughs> What is wrong? What is wrong with it? What is wrong with it? Something is so freaking wrong right now. Oh my god, it just came back to life. Okay, getting out of the way. Getting out of the way. I don't know what's wrong with you. You're a freaking zombie. Ow. Pepe, Pepe, save my life. Okay, do we have to like kill this thing twice or something? Is this a glitch? Maybe it's, maybe it's frenzied with Feral Wavern virus or something, but the quest didn't say that. It doesn't look any different. I don't know what's going on! I don't really, I don't really know anything about the Feral Wavern virus, if this is it. Okay, just, just take it down. Just take him down. We can do this. It's okay, it wasn't that easy, so I'm actually glad about that. Nope, we, nope, I'm hanging on to you. You can't throw me. I am the Rodeo King. Nope, I'm gonna beat you. Gotcha. You sit down, punk. Yes! I don't know what happened there. They're probably gonna address it, just because I was so crazy. Yeah! That was actually really freaky. That got me. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Rubbery hide. Nice. We need that to build our boat, remember? We're going sailing! Even though, since his corpses were all over the place, we seriously could have just grabbed one that, like, a Nursilla killed and, you know, use it. But we didn't. We ain't smart. But we didn't. We ain't smart. Nope. Let's, uh, go mining while we're standing right here. Yay! Mining! Maca... Macalite ore. You know what? I... What happened? Is it supposed to... Does it, like, play dead for a bit? Was it still taking damage? I don't... I didn't think so. I thought I tried to hit it and nothing happened. I mean, I... No idea. Quest over! Yeah! What happened? What happened? I want more story. Oh, I'm so excited for the story. I want to know what's going on. The quest is complete. And what do we got here? We got rubbery hide, rubbery hide, wyvern fang, rubbery hide. So many rubbery hides, man. Gloom glass root, which I already know those are good now. Iron ore, spider web, and some speed nectar thunder, which that one doesn't look that great because it's not increasing that much. But I don't really know. I'm trying to learn. Oh, thanks, Pepe. You just got me a mushroom. And okay, muscle look the room. Claustro panic. <laughs> Has been out of the gallery. Oh, great. Gipsros is now on Expeditions. That's great. That's just grand. I'm so happy. We're saving our progress. There's got to be some story that got unlocked right there. I just know it, because it's the only thing they wanted us to do. Thank you. Covers the ship materials. Come see me in Hearth. Hmm? I was going to say, don't tell me that was all the story. Oh, <gasps> cutscene. What is it, Mr. Kitty Cat? There's Mr. Guildmarm. Hi, Guildmarm. Hey, I got pants. Is that... What's that? That guy's got some nice armor. Okay. He's not wearing a helmet, though. He's an idiot. Pepe, you better steal something. That's what you cats are good for. Huh, I got a better hunter. Magami! Ah, I can talk with my mouth shut, too. Not really. Yeah. Check out her waist. You better block while she gets the explicit stuff going on. Okay. Something's funny. What's up, Pepe? Huh. Pepe's trying to be cute. The problem is it's working. Here comes some guy with some really nice... It looks like the dual slicers. Mock slicers. Jack, I don't remember what they're called. Okay, so now I totally feel like an amateur because everybody else has got better stuff than me. 
Ace Commander. You're the hunter? You? Really? The hunter is you? The hunter? Me? Am I? It is I? This one here? This person? What? Oh no, no problem at all. You're just not quite the same level as my expectations. I see. That's nice. That's that's how I feel right now when my friends are playing the game, because I'm filming mine as a Let's Play and everyone else is in G rank. I need to vent that real quick. Okay, back to the game. I hear your services were procured back in Valhabar. You are the hunter. Incredible. I knew you were the other fairy from Valhabar. You... You're all anyone talked about. I just expected someone more... Nothing. Pay me no mind. I won't, you jerk. But merit me. Just one question. Are you prepared to defend the caravan from any danger? And I mean any danger, not just the tiny dangers you can handle. Yeah. The reason I ask is because if any harm befalls your companions, you will have to answer to me. Personally. Well, I can take them! We did good on that last quest. It's okay, the Zip Gipsaros was only a zombie, and they didn't explain it. Okay, then. So, let's try and figure that out. Hi, Mr. Ace Cadet. Hey there, Beardy. He noticed! How much for that thingy there? Ooh, my stick in my mouth? Mm-mm, mm-mm, mine. Made of solid gold. Mm, I don't think I've got enough. Yeah, yeah, you bet you don't. How about psycho serums? Can I hook a Mombra up? Mombra? Oh, whatever. Uh, what do you mean you're out? But really, really need a psycho serum. I have a top secret mission. Pretty please? Hmm, hi there. Do I know you? Wait, oh yeah, I saw you back in the Battle of R. Catch, catch a what's up. Aw, oh, God, no. Even they're making the puns. It's bad when I do it, but they did it. What's that? You talk to the commander? Seriously? He chewed you out during your very first conversation? Oh, so he was supposed to. Now that's a new record. He didn't wrath the lose it. Oh, it's bad. With it, uh, with me, with it, with me until like our second chat. High five. I've totally got to introduce you to the rest of the game. There's like a story going on here. It's not that in depth, but there's something happening in a Monster Hunter game. Um, Ace Gunner, she's totally chill, Bray. That means she makes a good split-second decisions. I know she saved my poogies more than once. Oh, okay then, buddy. Guy over there talking to your carabineer is a vet. In fact, he makes your average vet look like a total noob. He was supposed to do some other mission or something, but he came back just to help us out. What a dude, what a gal, what a person. And the scary looking guy in blue who gave you the blast furnace treatment is the commander. He's not so bad though. In fact, I look up to him. When I first started out hunting, he took me under his wing. Hey, maybe he yelled at you because he thinks you're pretty okay. That's how it started out with me. Anyway, we're all friends here. Go in peace. <laughs> so he was just introducing me to the story or something like that. Hey, Mr. Market Man wants to talk to me. Hey, Hunter, lady at the Valabar Market filled me in. You agreed to deliver the sushi fish, and you didn't even make an annoyed face or anything. Actually, I did. I was kind of annoyed that episode. Ya big lugamajug. Think you could do me a solid, too? I can drop you several solids. My little and put together a fish bowl the other day, but she doesn't have any fish to put in it. What? Since I'm lousy at fishing, I was hoping you could bring me some small golden fish. Oh, I really had a pleasure to get my god fish wish. Count on you, Hunter, big time. Anyway, let's talk you more spendy. Eh. See, that's the kind of quest I'm like, I don't really want to do that on film. What do you got? Do you have anything new? Hey, your money's down, or cost is down, or whatever. We're looking at stuff. That's what I'm doing. We got a ton of cash. Probably buy the next book of combos. And honestly, we can afford the next one, too. So that's the first three books, and outside of that, I think we're good. Did I buy the organizer guide last time? I don't know. But whatever, we're good. Don't be a stranger. I totally will, man. You want me to go fishing. I finally moved on with my life. Hey, man. Splendid work hunting the Gipsaros. Now that Gipsaros materials are on the market, I can gather what I need. The caravan will soon have a fine ship because of you. You should be proud. Oh, have you spoken with the street cook? He had a favor to ask of you. Now, shall we? Uh, crap baskets! Actually, here, let me show you what those weapons were really quickly. Um, apparently I had a dual blade one as well. Let's sort everything so I can see what I'm doing. Ah, uh, that actually just kind of mixed things up. Whatever. 
uh, V Prey Claws. I'm assuming that's like Velociprey stuff, so it's not that fantastic. Whatever. Can I like actually see what they look like? You know, because I like the pictures. Frontier Lance. This is a water type lance. Looks kind of cool. This is way stronger though. Doesn't have the green sharpness. But it has plus 10 defense. Has a slot that's taken. I wonder what that means. Man, I, I feel like something's coming up through my stomach. Alright, so dragon type, that's amazing. But I really don't think, um, I was gonna say I don't think Lance is very good, but I just really stink with them. This um, is the rough edge though, and I'm surprised that the rough edge is doing ice damage. Because I remember the rough edge from the other games, and it didn't do that. But I want it. That looks like a ball and chain. What is that? Bishop Talisman. Um, auto guard. Oh, whatever. Cannot be upgraded. So it's our only talisman at the moment, so whatever. Hey, can we finally give something to Pepe? Like, you know, outside Aiden the man. Congratulations on being not dead. Douche. So, no. Looks like no. It looks like no. Pepe, you're just gonna be screwed for a while. So, let's go down here. Oh, so many people! Let's talk to you, because I know you're part of the story! Hi, boob lady. Oh, well, hello there. How was the hunt? You, you know, of course I know you. You're of the caravaner team, right? It's a pleasure to finally meet you. Uh, I don't even know who you are. Us? We're here to investigate. A certain monster. Serious business. I'll let you know. Anyway, I'm changing my voice multiple times here. Anyway, we're doing just a out-of-order sentence reading. I quick stop over at this village. I hear you've come to build a ship. Well, the other guy did. I, I'm just kind of with him. So I don't have to, you know, gather mushrooms and fish anymore. Ocean is serious business, too. I suppose we should both try to help each other out as much as we can. Have you met our fearless leader yet? Yeah, the douchebag. He's the guy in blue who looks constipated. That's exactly how I would describe him as well. Don't worry, he may not be a champion smiler, but he won't break your kneecaps either. Are you sure? I hope he didn't lay into you about... Oh, he did. Sorry. Try to pretend he's a shark while he talks. Eh, <laughs> what a cue. Because that's the, you know, sharks in this game have cues. Whatever. You'll look at him a totally different way. Yeah. That's... That's great. That's some great advice. Look at the commander guy as if he is trying to murder me. And it will all just settle in a little bit... Uh, simpler. I don't know. So, dude, I can see the pixels in your shield there. Ah, oh, the infamous hunter I've heard all about. You're from the Caravaneer. It gladdens me. He has found a worthy-looking replacement. You know, guys, I would be just as strong as you if I just had better equipment. That's it. That is seriously all I need. Better weapon, better equipment. I'm equal to you. <laughs> I do am a hunter. My com companions and I are called the Ace Hunters. Dun, dun, dun. But really, all that means is that we've been around for too long. Yeah, it sounds like it. I must say, the caravan looks far livelier than I remember it. Perhaps I was the one souring the mood. I used to be a member, you see. Ever since I left, I have wondered if I made the right decision. You did! Not that the guild gave me much choice. They summoned me specifically for this new mission. Actually, I don't know. I know nothing about the story, so maybe there's something really awesome that we're going to find later. Like a Gormagala. That kind of awesome. Monstrous tasks like this are in honor for any hunter, the caravaneer said. Take care of your new leader. He tried to make my departure easier, and now I know he is in good hands again with you. Oh, it's so nice. I am confident you will take good care of him and the rest of the group. How do I know? Because he knows he chose you. Like a Pokemon he did. Just mind that he doesn't drag you headlong into danger. He likes doing that. I can imagine. He seems like that kind of guy. Okay, left or right, let's talk to uh, the Waikun. Man, everyone wanted to talk to us. Ah, Hunter, splendid timing. The street cook has asked me if I could help him get his hands on higher quality milk. Yeah, he's a cat, that's what he wants. However, I need to gather just a few small things before I can make his dairy dreams come true. Think you can help me out? Check out the villager requests if you want to know all the delicious details. I'm counting on you. All right, let's make with the transactions. I have some new hunting necess necessities for you today. Oh, you do? You have a new request. Cool. What is it? Um, can I do it, like, right now? Sweet, I can. What is this? Milk does 100 fine. So I actually don't have to bring him milk. I just have to give him caravan points. This is how I did the other one earlier, guys, just so I, um, get it on film. I didn't realize this was how you're supposed to do it. Go to the request stuff. So, yay! Here you go. Whatever. I already did it. Level up ingredient dairy. Nice! Fine work, Hunter. Now the open-air kitchen will always be stocked with the best dairy delights. The street cook said to you, Zenny, thanks. Yeah, that's, that's that was bad. 
So let's talk to Mr. Cookie. He's probably going to want to talk to us twice now. Hunter, I thought of a way to make the Traverians feel better. I'll cook them some of my number one meals. That's a good idea, meow. A full stomach is the path to true happiness, after all. A lot of people will agree with you, Mr. Kitty Cat. A lot of people out there. But to make this delicious meals, I need delicious ingredients. The vendor, I do business, says they'll send higher quality ingredients if I capture a Gendrum. Mmm. Hunter, you'll help me capture a Gendrum, meow. It'll be so easy, I promise. Hmm, that sounds a little bit more interesting. I was hoping we'd have something better to look forward to than more fish. Because I don't want to go hunting more fish. By hunting, I mean fishing fish. The Tribarians already got better. I thought of a good plan for nothing. I oh well. Why not capture a Gendrum anyway? We can upgrade the ingredients. I, whatever. I'm not even getting a good reason for why you need to do that quest. I already have the guild marm, the quest. I named it a roadwork. For monster capture, you need trank bombs and shock traps, or pitfall traps. I gotcha. I recommend you take many in your pouch. Good luck! Well, you can only carry one at a time. Uh, now somebody down here wants to talk to us, and I think it's the Guildmarm. Hi, Mr. Guildmarm. I'm calling you a mister because you call me a doodle, and I don't like that. Hi, doodle. I heard the story. The street cook needs your help. The relevant quest is called road work. So, you need to capture a monster this time. To do it, Doodle, you need to have a Trank Bombs, a Shock Trap, a Pit Ball Trap as well. The first game will just give you all that stuff. It was great. Supply items will cover you to some extent. Oh, good. But you can always bring your own just to be extra safe. Yeah, that's kind of bad. Like, you go through the whole thing, and you, like, mess up, and you just, like, uh, you'll see in the quest. You can always... You can also buy materials at the market to build your own traps. If you want to have a look. Any questions? Of course you have questions. Oh, you want to know about that hunter with the lance the boss was talking to. Oh, not really. I don't care. That's right. You don't know the story. Nah, I, those four hunters are known as the Ace Hunters. They, I knew that, actually. The guild sends them out with important, sometimes top secret missions. The one with the lance was a member of our caravan until recently. When the mission from the guild came in, however, he left. Not that there are any hard feelings. I, for one, am happy to see him in such good health. Anyway, here come quests. Whatever, what was that about? Whatever. Okay, so let's take a look. Um, Quest-wise that we haven't done in three, I am seeing this one, Catch a Watch a Wallop, which is just Hunt Catch a Watch a. It's just in a danger area. Um, that's also in the S Hollow. Slay eight Genprey. Whatever. You know, we can do that as a warm-up for the Gendrome quest coming up next. Crystal Bone Collector, we didn't do that. I think I did um, one simple quest like that. I think it might have been a two. Fish Wish, the four small golden fish, yeah. Um, ooh, Congas. Slay five Congas. I've never fought a Conga. They were only in the second game, and I never played the second game. Well, I played a little bit of the second game, but not that much. Fish Wish, this is on one of their... Um, what does that mean? Let's... Oh, oh, shoot. Whoa! Okay, we already fought him. I'm trying to read over here. Let's see. Do I look like I could give a flying film about fish? My lie lay uncertainly dog. She made golden fish tank and everything. Guess I ought to fill it. Small golden fish will do. Cute ones. Why is this a level 3 quest? There's something wrong. Oh, it's in a danger zone. There's something wrong with that quest. I got a feeling I should film it. Congo Bongo. That sounds kind of cool, too. And capture the Gendrum. I actually think, because we have some options here, I think we should try and work our way up to road work, which is probably not going to be that difficult, but still, we'll figure it out. So, I've got a feeling that that Gypsaros was actually doing some, like, playing dead tactic or something. I don't know, but regardless, that is all going to happen in the next episode, so thank you all so much for watching. Remember to like the videos and subscribe, and I will see you all in the next Monster Hunter fight. See ya!